Okay. I and heard that's it. your man, so you can't you can't call Yellow a liar or else you guys are gonna be beefing again. I mean, I beef with Yellow right now. I already got something to say. It hit different. You did a song with him like the other day, right? Yeah, I do a song. I ain't doing no songs with my motherfucking King Yellow, bro. Wasn't that the didn't you drop a music video with him the other day? Or was that Hell no, he dropping old shit. That's why? Old, uh, why? Why? Because Jay Main lit right now. So what King Yellow doing? Mm. He sucking, bro. Mm. He want to be on my good side, bro. It hit different when you want to be on my good side. No, that's your friend now, though, right? Like you Not as my friend. Not as my friend. What happened? Because he sucking to the maximum. Again? And so you guys are beefing again? I'm asking you. I don't know. I'm asking you. I don't know, bro. What do I know? I'm asking you because I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't believe that we real friends, bro. Really? How can I believe that, bro? It hit different. So you feel like people chasing it off your name? It hit different, bro. Have this been hitting different lately or not? Yeah, you're blowing up and... It hit different. That, so now you're flexing on them. It hit different. I just seen a video of you, Yella, Ruga, and somebody else all hanging out. This like last week. Ruga too. Nice as hell. It hit different. Do your homework. Do your homework. Nice as hell. Told his ass I was going to smack him. What'd he do? Bro, he invited me to the studio. I don't want to do no songs with you. Once you just on the interviews talking about you don't want to do no songs with me, I'll bug the fuck up. Ruga. <laughs> it hit different, bro. It different. So everybody tapping in now. Now they, now they want to do woos with FYBJ Main. I'll bug the fuck up. It hit different. What do you think of my Ruga interview? I don't get no fuck about your Ruga interview. You seen it? It, it, it ain't do more numbers than the FYBJ Main interview. That is true. But did do you your see homework. it? Did I see it? Did I see it? We I don't know, bro. I Funky Man on camera. Oh, yeah. I think that. That he was disrespectful, bro. He don't even want to be called that. Why the f would you have Thunky Man sitting in this seat, bro? Because I was trying I to build the, the story where I was supposed to have him sitting next to me. Nah, 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 y'all want to know. Why you keep going up on the prices? Why the f I invite Vite Thunky Man to y'all show? It hit different. So that's your, like your mortal enemy? Like what? I bug the f up. That's my arch nemesis. Poe, it hit different. What the, what the f is going on? What the fuck is going on? You whooping. I'll bug the fuck up. <laughs> I'm just trying to get you right, gang. They, <laughs> they whooping, bro. No it hit them. So you said you wouldn't do a song with Yellow. Would I do a song with Yellow, bro? For what? For what? Why y'all hanging out and shit if you ain't really if you ain't really rocking with them like that? If you you got this to say, but you were just with them like two weeks ago. They they wanted me to hang with them, bro. They wanted me to hang with them, bro. I ain't called them. They called me. I I I put on for the side, bro. I'm still FYBJ man. I gotta put on for for, for our side, bro. I still gotta do whoops, bro. I still gotta whoop with phone number, bro. We ain't gotta get along, but we got we gotta make the side look real good, bro. It hit different. Just like y'all mentioning phone number in this interview, I'm blowing up. I ain't gotta mention phone number. I could be dissing somebody else right now. I could be dissing somebody else. Do your homework on me dissing other people while I'm hot. It hit different. But so are but you? Are you? I'd rather the sauce go back to phone number. It hit different. Are you homework. even really like trying to do the rapper thing still? Or are you just f strictly focused on, I don't know, whatever YouTube and doing interviews and whatnot? Say it one more time. Are you still trying to make rap music and music videos, or is that part of your life over? Do I want to make rap music? I do be making rap music on phone number. I still be dropping shit from time to time on bro because I got I got hella rap music fans, bro. I did hella millions of views and shit, tens of millions of views before this talking shit that I be doing now. I was doing that shit off of music, so it's it, it hit different when. Um, J Man, why you ain't rapping? It hit different. I hear that every day. I get tired of motherfuckers. Um, we need music, J Man. We need music. I get tired of the whoops on bro. Then I see up my new fan base getting that. Damn, he did music. It hit different. He does music. Right. It different. So would you would you drop a project at this point in your career? With who? I don't know. Just just maybe you. Maybe Thunky oh. Man can make you some beats. I don't I don't need Thunky Man beats, bro. So you want me to be homeless again, Adam? And you know what? That's how I realized that you really are a racist is once I realized that Thunky Man was white. And that's why you talked down about him. No, because Thunky Man um, took my YouTube channel, bro. Also, he's white. What the fuck do that got to do with it? Y'all always putting race in it. Like, then we just, what, what else we just, just talking about and you put race in it? It don't have nothing. It got all got, look, every time a J. Mayne say something, what it got something to do with? YouTube. Um, nice. Nah, it, it, it different. Like, you you fucking with what I got going on. It hit different. Uh, yeah, okay. But what do you think about Thunky Mane's appearance on here? I didn't li I didn't want you to interview him. I was very upset. I was very, I was very upset. I was punching the screen. Any, Why? Anytime, you? anytime I see Thunky Man, bro. I'm punching screens, bro. Donkey man. Was there anything that he said that was wrong, though? Because I walked away from the conversation thinking that he handled it pretty maturely. He tried to contact you. He tried to talk to you. He tried to get, you know, money for the beats or whatever. 
you weren't hearing it. You weren't calling him back. So he went, boom, scorched earth. Take the channel. All right, that's enough. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> I, does that bother it you? It hit different when they put too much sauce on it. I bet. He ca I came away from it thinking that he seemed like a reasonable lucky guy. I, what I say, y'all lucky I be letting them in, ask them shit like this on me, on the interviews because I ain't even got to let them ask, ask me about you motherfuckers. So let, let's let start there. It hit different. Okay. All right, before we move from the uh, Lil J topic. But, but I want to say on the Ruga thing, do you, how do you feel about Ruga coming at me crazy because I put his interview up even though he asked me not to? I talked to Ruga personally about that. Ooh. Um, it do it different. He was bo he bogus. He bogus, eh, man. He exploiting the whoop. Oh, always with this shit. <laughs> He's a culture vulture. They decide I'm a culture vulture at the exact moment that they decide they don't like me and they need a reason. <laughs> so fucking obvious. Nah, but that, but he was whooping though. It's, it, it's it's halfway a whoop though. Because all right, this is my thing. It's halfway a whoop, but you took it serious. Let's though. do a that, study. That's that's the whole thing. Let's watch every single Ruga Ruga interview ever done, and then you and then watch mine and tell me what percentage of it was spent talking about his ops and or Lil Dirk. I'm guaranteeing that mine had the lowest percentage of beef talk that anybody's interview that he's ever done had. Really, from what I remember, the only question I asked him was about Academics, his interview with Dirk, where he asked him about not going to the Kanye concert in Chicago because of the fact that he knew Ruga was going to be there. And we got to hear Lil Dirk say Ruga's name for maybe the first time, or at least the first time in a long time. In an interview, you know these guys, they don't like to say their ops names. All I'm saying is that that interview did not have a lot of op talk. Nah, that was facts. Thank you. you. <laughs> that was facts. It hit different. It, it, it was real. Like, when once I reviewed it, but he said, once I was in the car with him, he can that. Nah, Jay, man, I really just told him um, I want to see the whoop before he whopped, and he still whooped. So that's not like, true. He told me he just didn't want to put it out. And that's what I ignored. Mm. Which but I can see that he said he said he just wanted, to, but that's what he, that's what folks told me. He said he I should have hit him on some man shit. Talking about all trolls, all trolling shit aside, that's what he said. Well, I should have hit him up and said, "Yo, I know you don't want me to put the interview out, but I'm gonna put the interview out anyway." Because I thought it was good, and I think your reason for me yeah, not yeah. wanting and me I, to I put feel it like out he would have, and I would, I, I feel like he would have respected that type yeah. of shit better. Like, you yeah, think he's gonna I'm, beat my ass when he sees me? No, I, don't, I, I feel like yeah, he fucked with you to a certain extent, like. Um, my foot chopped that shit up. Ooh. He told me he was gonna beat my ass. <laughs> oh, he did. Oh, he definitely he might beat your so. ass then. I told him I was gonna beat his ass. Oh, it hit different when y'all beat each other ass. It hit different. <laughs> beat the fuck out of each other on no jumper is crazy. Y'all be whooping. Right? So now when I go to Vegas, I gotta be moving around a certain type of whoop. It hit different. You hold on. Do you got a pokeball on you? No comment. Do your it very different. When I don't have a pokeball. Right. Do your homework on I don't have a pokeball. Ruga don't touch him. <laughs> Different. I'm uh, level 50 in Pokemon Go. <laughs> this is my uh, apprentice. He's like 47. Yeah, I ain't there yet. I got to get to the 50. I need everybody to check out NoJumber.com. We officially started a blog. It has in-depth articles about current events, music, etc. Plus all of our content in terms of podcasts, interviews, etc. And you can get some exclusive new merch if you check out NoJumber.com. So make sure you tap in.